Okay, so let's go ahead and continue our work on our Waypoint Manager window. So in the previous video, we have created a menu item to open the Waypoint Manager window. Okay, then we show the uh, Waypoint Manager window with this specific title. Now, after this, we need to create a reference to the transform representing the origin point for new waypoint okay so we're gonna say public transform waypoint origin okay so to this waypoint origin we're gonna provide a game object and then when we uh, uh, click on the create waypoint button then inside this waypoint origin it will create waypoints one by one okay and then we can place them wherever we want okay now after this as I told you we will be creating a button so let's define the GUI layout for the editor window okay so we're gonna say private world actually let me type on GY okay we have that option okay so on GY now in here what we're gonna do is first of all we're gonna create a serialized object for the waypoint manager window instance okay so we're gonna say nope serialized object let's name this as obj and this is going to be equals to new serialize object and then we're going to say this okay then after this we're going to display a property field in the editor for assigning the waypoint origin okay so we're going to say editor gui layout dot property field obj dot find property and let's pass the uh, waypoint origin in here okay it's name then after this we are gonna check if the waypoint origin is uh, not assigned and display a warning if so okay so we are gonna say waypoint origin is equals to null then we are gonna say editor GUI layout dot help box and in here you can type whatever message you want like that your waypoint origin is empty or I will just type please assign a waypoint origin transform okay and uh, I add a full stop and then I give one space right there and then after that in here I will type message type dot warning okay now if the waypoint origin is now assigned then what we're gonna do okay right here in the else if a waypoint origin is assigned we're gonna display a box and create a button and that button will be by the name of create waypoint okay so first of all right here we're gonna say editor GUI layout okay then we're gonna say dot begin vertical because we want our buttons uh, I mean for now we just have one button we want that button to be shown in the vertical direction okay so we're gonna say begin vertical and we're gonna say box and then after this right here we are gonna call a method and that method will be by the name of create button or let's just say create buttons if you want to create more buttons okay and don't worry we're gonna create this method but after this when we begin a vertical uh, thing we need to end that as well so right here instead of now the begin I will type end vertical okay and you need to add round brackets at the end simple as that 
and now before uh, creating this create buttons method let me just copy this okay before doing that uh, let's apply any modified properties to these realized object okay this object so we're gonna say obj dot apply modified properties okay now let's create uh, the method to create buttons in the editor window okay so we're gonna paste that name and at the start just type void and now in here what we gonna do we gonna check if the create waypoint button is pressed okay then when it is pressed we gonna call another method and that method will be by the name of create waypoints okay so first of all we gonna say if the GUI layout dot button and let's name this button as create waypoint okay if this create waypoint is pressed we're gonna create a waypoint okay and we're gonna create that in this create uh, waypoint method all right for now if I comment this out and save it and also make sure to type P right there property field okay now if you get back right here okay if we uh, uh, see right here in the waypoint editor tools window we now uh, need to provide the uh, waypoint origin as you can see it is showing this warning as well because this is what we type in our code okay so for example uh, let's create waypoints from here from this start okay so if I move my camera right here and let's create a game object by the name of waypoint origin and make sure that this is on the ground okay so you can move it right here to the ground okay I think it is uh, far away but let's just move it right here okay so now as you can see it is right here on the ground okay so now if we assign this right there as you can see when we assign it it shows this create uh, waypoint button but for now as you can see when we click it it doesn't create any waypoint okay so in the next video whenever we click on this create waypoint we're gonna create a waypoint and to that waypoint we're gonna assign this waypoint script and then uh, whenever uh, any opponent car reaches that waypoint then the opponent car will know that what is the next waypoint and what is the previous waypoint and uh, according to that information the opponent car will move forward or backward okay so let's do this in the next video